Yo guys, what's going on? It's Lincoln from NK Lacrosse, and this is my first video on this channel. I have two other channels, um, NK Lacrosse, and I also, not NK Lacrosse, I have NK Sports, sorry about that, I have NK Sports, and then I have y Yeti's Lacrosse as well. Um, I just thought, since I have a Yeti's Lacrosse account, I'll also, I'll also make a NK Lacrosse account. So, uh, today, for my first video, I have a gear bag video. Um, this is my 2018 NK Lacrosse gear bag. And so let's just hop right into it. Starting with the uniform. So we only have three things. Um, we have two jerseys, white and Carolina. Our colors are Carolina and white and black. So Tridents, I am number 21. Um, Tridents is our team name. And number 21 on the back in Carolina. And then for our Carolina jerseys, we have North on them right there. Uh, they're made by Nike, so I, th I just thought that was pretty cool. Again, number 21, same there. And then our shorts. Um, a lot of teams in our area actually don't have shorts for their team. And they only have one jersey, so we're pretty lucky to have that. Uh, they're pretty nice. Again, they're made by Nike. You can see the North Kids up across right there. So, um, let's get into my helmet, I guess. So, I have a, a Cascade CPVR. Um, I have two NK lacrosse stickers. I'm going to take this one off, though, because I just bought some um, helmet numbers that I'm going to put on there. I'm going to put 20... I'm gonna put 21 on there. Um, they're black. I wish they were in like a Carolina or a gray or something, but I can only find them in black and I'm, I'm not gonna go shopping online for them. But yes, so it's a regular CPVR. Um, I have three Honor the Game stickers. See if I can get that into focus. Honor the Game, Washington chapter. So um, yeah, here they are. Um, so the honor the game stickers if you do not know and you don't have them in your area or whatever so they are basically you get them after the game if the coaches say yeah we'll let them do it um and by it i mean the kids pick and not, uh so i should probably start with this sorry i'm, I'm, uh, I'm not good at explaining things but so you have two or three captains from each team and then those captains pick two or three people from the other team who they thought did exceptionally well and they give them on the game stickers i have three um i got them all three in a row so that's pretty awesome i'm hoping for a fourth next weekend on our next game um against a pretty good team so i'm gonna really try and go hard on, on that game so yes cascade cpvr i'm gonna get a new helmet probably in 2019 it's gonna be a um it's gonna be a cpxr it's a full carolina with a white chin strap i think i don't know if it's gonna be black or white um but it's gonna be cool and i'm excited to get it so next i'll just go into my chest protector um this isn't really good position oriented um these are very stick uh sticky to the velcro sheesh i just washed them so yeah here we go um they are brines there's a bit of shine sorry about that i'll try and cover that up so they're brine um i think they're clutch something uh see if i can find it but they are black gray and neon green which I thought was a bit interesting. These are my my main pair. I have another pair that I don't use, but yeah, um, I'm not gonna show those because I don't use them. So um, I guess I was going to cleats. So for cleats, I have these Under Armour. I almost said I said Under Armour. Why did I do that? They're Warrior. I don't know what they are. I have a box somewhere, but I'm, I'm not going to go dig up that box. But they are white, gray, and again, neon green. I don't know what the deal is with the neon green stuff. I only got these because they were on sale for super cheap. Dick Sporting Goods, their size 11. Um, I might need a new pair here soon because these are getting a bit snug on my foot. And you can actually see from our last game, I got stepped on and then it pulled. So, I'm not 
have to fix that. But and that hurt. That hurt a lot because uh, the, the the person had metal cleats, so that wasn't fun. Um, so I guess next I'll get into the gloves because I have three pairs of gloves with me. Um, so first are um, probably my main pair. I say probably because again I have three, and I I really only use two. I use these ones, white and black line, um, with red on the inside. Just super basic, just white and black. Um, I think the other one has, has dried blood on it. It does not. I washed it out. Okay. Um, the first the, uh, the first tournament that I wore these in the first game of the first tournament that I wore these, I got a bloody nose, and I bled all over the fingers, but yeah, so this is just the brine, black and white brines. So next on are my secondary pair, they are black SDX stairs, and um, all of these gloves that I'm showing are pretty comfortable, um, the grip on them isn't that great, um, I think the the white ones have the best grip, and, and that's why I'm using them. But again, here they are. Simple, again, right on the inside. And these ones are my favorite looking ones. I just don't wear them because they're red, and I don't wanna, like, stick out like a sore thumb, to say. But I like these a lot. They're super comfortable. And I guess it has a across unlimited uh, kind of stitching wrap right there. So I guess I got these off of across un uh, uh, unlimited. A teacher actually gave me these. Um, her son played lacrosse and then he moved on to college. So she gave me these. Um, my, my favorite part on these is probably on the cuff. It's, uh, it's a stick of dynamite. It says uh, sabotage on it. So I think that's pretty cool. But, um, so I think I have elbow pads. Uh, I can't find them. Still. But I have these. Um, they are warrior regulars, yes. They are super short, um, snug fit, white, black. Fairly simple. Um, the black's kind of coming off. You can't even kind of see it on the camera. But it's coming off. So. Here's the other one. Um, these are my new ones. I'm um, gonna show you the old ones now. And if you ask me, quite an improvement. These are not comfortable. Um, they ripped easily. I was late to a tournament and I had to get them on quick, so I pulled on this light fabric part and it ripped. I'll show you that in a minute when I'm done putting these on. Um, these aren't very comfortable, first of all. And second of all, they're not very protective because sometimes either they push down really hard right there, right there and it hurts as you can see right, right there it's kind of pushing down and pushing my skin up and then so sometimes when I get into the skirmish they'll go down and then I've ha I actually have them go all the way down there so I definitely would not recommend these but I, I have seen people who play really good in them um, so I do not have my primary short stick here but I do have my secondary short stick. So I strung this up myself. I'm learning how to, to string. Um, I'm decent at it. I can string a decent mid pocket. Um, good for shooting and passing. Um, this is just a warrior shaft. I don't know what that said underneath because this is not my shaft. I think it said warrior. That looks like a... O R C H Orch. That's what it looks like. So warrior and a uh, white warrior table next head. Uh, strung up with some hero strings and some hero mesh. And then my primary stick altogether is over here. It's my Nike Vandal C pole. I I play defense and occasionally some LSM. And it's on a Nike Lakota U. Uh, it's on this side, you can't really see it. It's right in there, it says Lakota U. And um, again, Hero Mesh Hero Strings. But yeah, and I guess just for fun, I'll show you guys my first attempt ever at a hard mesh stringing. 
I don't see how you people string with hard mesh. I strung it up the same way I would string up a short stick, or not a short stick, uh, the way I would string up a, so a semi-soft mesh stick, and it does not work. Um, this isn't really good mesh either. I think if I redo it, I can make it a lot better. But this mesh sucks. It's warrior mesh, and that's the deepest I can make it go. But anyway, guys, um, I guess that's gonna wrap it up for this video. And if you guys enjoyed, I'll show you guys all my gear right here. There's all that, and then there's my helmet and my um, clothes right there. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.